Alright, let's do this in 10. 1, 2, about this one because today we are taking a look at the brand new Club Cannon handheld version 2 and today we're going to be unboxing it and taking a look at the differences between the old model and the new model. I'm really excited to show you guys this because you guys know CO2 is one of my favorite add-ons that I do. What is it? It's uh, CO2. Is it going to make the floor wet? No, no. Is it CO2 water? No, it's air. No, it's not going to crush the air. No, H, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I love the energy that this thing brings. You know, as soon as you fire one of these bad boys, the place is going to go nuts. about a year ago we unboxed this club cannon handheld right here this is actually the original handheld that you see right here really the product has remained the same but they did add some awesome new aesthetic features if you will let's get inside the box Ta -da! wow this thing is uh way more beefy looking it definitely looks more hardcore this my friends is the club cannon handheld Mark 2, just like Iron Man. So what they've done is they've actually gone ahead and permanently mounted the previously removable hand grip. So the way this works is you kind of just slide it in like so. Then you're going to want to twist and that's going to lock it. This was kind of awkward. If you didn't go out and purchase this separately, it was a little bit awkward because I don't know if you guys have ever fired a CO2 gun, but the barrel tends to freeze over when you're firing it. So what they've gone ahead is they've actually permanently mounted it and now you never have to go through this process ever again. Also, you don't have to buy it separately because it comes pre-attached and in doing that they've also made the barrel look a lot cooler this looks a lot cleaner in the newer model than in the old one but aside from that nothing's really changed you still have your lock here at the bottom you still have your quick connect there on the bottom and it just feels a lot a lot nicer in the hand and also I think it's a little bit lighter no they're about the same way but I don't know this one just feels this one just feels right. The shipping box also works great for transport, it looks like. They did a great job designing the box. Inside the box, you'll get the tightening tool. You really need this bad boy. You'll get some washers for your hose. You get a set of five and an instruction manual. I've made a video on these before, which I highly recommend that you go watch. It goes into detail about how you go about getting these CO2 tanks. You need the dip tube tanks, the siphon tanks, there's a ton of different names for them, the red tops. Um, it really just depends on where you get them, but if you don't get a tank with a dip tube, a siphon tank with this red top, um, the red top won't always be present. But if you don't get that, the effect will not. I repeat, the effect will not work, so be very careful when you're out there buying the CO2. Lastly, we get an 8-foot hose. Oh, I'm so excited for this. I'm like a kid on Christmas. So, what we do is we take one of these little washers here, and we go right inside. First, I usually do it with my hand. First, I do it with my hand, and then I take the wrench, and I tighten tight do the velcro and we're gonna go right into our co2 gun it's a quick connect super easy to do right here on the bottom clip in and lock now when you're turning on your co2 tank you want to do it kind of slow because if you have any leaks you want to be able to shut it off the hose is also going to get some pressure so just be aware of that and we'll see if we have any leak no leak all right so I got my pressure on, the gun is ready. Official first firing of the Club Cannon handheld Mark II. I can't emphasize how good this feels in the hand. It just feels so 
So right, one, two. Oh my God, I just shot down my light. These things never get old. <laughs> original handheld about almost a year and a half ago and it's been a tremendous 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 success it just brings such a level of energy to your events that really no other effect brings I don't know why but when you fire this people just seem to lose their mind. One of the most rewarding things about this year was going back through some of my events where we brought out the club cannon and seeing that awesome shot of the bride and groom on top of my subwoofer with the gun just blasting it off at the crowd. That is a million dollar promo shot. It's so freaking awesome and it's well worth the money. And come on, look at the new look of this thing. It just looks so freaking bad as it's an easy and relatively inexpensive add-on that you can add to your events so this new guy is actually replacing this guy so the price points remain similar it's now at a $300 price point you'll get the hose you'll get the tightening tool and you'll get the washers you will have to go out and get your co2 which is not that expensive you can usually get them for about I would say as low as $25 up to like $35 for a 20 pounder like this. We typically bring four of these tanks to my events and that might sound excessive but the thing is we don't actually fire them we give them to the guests to fire them we give them to the bride and groom to fire them and they do tend to go a little bit crazy with it so i highly recommend that you guys pick it up i have been loving mine you guys see it in a ton of my videos i don't have to preach to you guys how much i love this thing because you guys see me use it so freaking much. I want to send a huge thanks to the guys over at Club Cannon for sending this unit for review. And my friends over at Club Cannon are hooking all you guys up for a limited time only with a discount if you use the promo code on your screen right now. What's more, huge thanks to the guys over at Club Cannon for sending it over. And most importantly, thank you bros for being awesome and watching and supporting the videos. If you have any questions, please leave them down below. I'll be down there interacting with you. Till next time, stay awesome bros. Peace.